Have you ever wondered why some products in your local market are suddenly so cheap? It almost seems too good to be true. Well, there's a hidden story behind those low prices, and it's not always good news for your country's own businesses. Cheap imports can sometimes do more harm than good, especially when they undercut local producers who are trying to make an honest living. Let's break down a practice called dumping. What it is, how it works, and why it's such a big deal for local economies around the world. Dumping happens when a country or company sells a product in another country for way less than what it actually costs to make, or even less than what they sell it for at home. This isn't just a small discount, it's a deliberate strategy to flood foreign markets with super cheap goods. At first glance, it sounds like a dream come true for shoppers. Who wouldn't want to pay less for the things they need? Those low prices can be really tempting, and it might seem like everyone wins. But there's a catch, a big one. These deals can come with hidden costs that most people don't see right away. Let's look at a real-world example to see how dumping can shake up an entire industry. Imagine a country like China, which is known for its massive steel production. Suppose China manufactures a ton of steel for 50,000 pounds, but then turns around and sells it in India for just 30,000 pounds. That's a huge loss on every sale, but it's done on purpose. Why would anyone sell at a loss? The goal is to make local Indian steel companies unable to compete because they simply can't match those rock-bottom prices. Over time, these local companies start losing customers, their profits shrink, and they may be forced to lay off workers or even shut down completely. The community suffers, jobs disappear, and the local economy takes a hit. It's not just about one company, it's about the livelihoods of thousands of people. And here's the real danger. Once the competition is wiped out, the foreign company, like China in our example, can become the only supplier left. With no rivals, they can suddenly raise prices as high as they want, and consumers have no choice but to pay. That's why governments around the world step in with things like tariffs, anti-dumping investigations, and other trade barriers. These measures are designed to protect local industries and keep the playing field fair. Sometimes you'll see protests or campaigns urging people to buy local, or governments introducing new rules to help their own businesses survive against unfair competition. So next time you spot an unbelievably cheap import, take a moment to think about what might be behind that price tag. Dumping isn't just about bargains. It can have serious consequences for your community and your country's future. For more easy explanations and tips on how global trade affects you, stay tuned to the fellow investors.